WSIL. You're watching News 3 This Morning with Evie Allen, Dave Davis, and meteorologist Nick Housen. We've got you covered. Well, Centralia is hoping to give families a special holiday this season and in a safe way. Brooke Slyer is live at Foundation Park to give us a sneak peek. Brooke. Good morning, Evie. Well, as you just said, I'm here in Centralia at Foundation Park where they're having their fantasy of lights display. Families can just go ahead and drive through when it gets dark and it's absolutely free. But there's other holiday happenings here in Centralia. And to tell me a little bit more this morning is Jessica. Thank you for waking up with me. And so we're talking about the Christmas stroll and this sounds like a really fun event. So go ahead and fill the viewers in. Oh, it's going to be an awesome event. We're inviting everyone to come out and see Centralia this holiday season starting this week. And we have a magical holiday plan with our annual downtown Christmas stroll. It's this Friday, December 4th, 3 p.m. to 7 p.m. And there's going to be something for everyone. So you all need to come out and see it. We have carriage rides, caroling, live musical entertainment, a live nativity scene. And rumor has it that a local coffee shop downtown is going to be bringing the snow. So we're going to have appearances by Santa, Wanda the Elf, of course. Uh, the Grinch, Elsa and Friends, Krampus, and more. So there's something for everyone. And if they can't make it this weekend, we also have a magical holiday running throughout the entire season. So we have a Nutcracker stroll that's downtown. It's featuring six life-size Nutcrackers, the perfect Instagram backdrop. And then we also have a tour that is offered, a self-guided tour, where people can come and drive through our town and check out the top 10 holiday decorated homes from our Outslay Your Neighbor Holiday Challenge. And they can find all this information on our website at ccentralia.com or on Facebook, ccentralia or Centralia IL Downtown District. That just sounds like so much fun, especially the carolers. I mean, that's just such a great time, almost like a Hallmark movie, you know, with the carriage yes. rides and everything like that. And before we go, you know, Wanda, it sounds like you're gonna be a little bit of everywhere. I mean, you're just popping up all over at these events. But you know, one last time, go ahead and fill in the viewers about the event that's going on at Castle Ridge with the uh, Santa mailbox. Uh, Castle Ridge is a, a official North Pole affiliate, thanks to, to Santa, and you can drop off letters to Santa um, and pick up free reindeer food for the kids, but you can go to castleridge.com or gsaplayball.com. We're going to choose five lucky winners. Well, Santa and his elves will actually come to your house and drop off Santa's favorite cookies. So we're excited. Uh, I'm excited to be Wanda and part of it, and we're also excited uh, at Castle Ridge to be a part of all the festivities. And for all our viewers, we're going to have the information about the Christmas stroll, the fantasy of lights, and about those Santa letters all on our website. That's WSILTV.com under News 3 this morning. But for now, over to you, John. Well, Brooke, the only thing brighter than those lights is the sun that's just now starting to come up.